All right, turning out of the weather this noon, meteorologist Mary Beth Robel tracking your seven weather forecast. I think you said pea, it's like pea it's soup like out pea there. It's like pea soup out there, Jeff. You know, it's so thick right now, you, can, you feel like you can cut the atmosphere with a knife. But this is the way it's going to stay right into the upcoming weekend. The dew point is running so high that leads to very high humidity. And also with this added humidity, it leads to the impetus for very, very heavy rain when the rain does get here. It's 81 degrees with mostly cloudy skies at the airport. Humidity quite high. And temperatures right now have moved into the low 80s across the Niagara frontier. It's 84 already at Middleport, 81 at Niagara Falls. And look at the Lake Erie water temperature. It's bumped up to 75 across the southern tier we have some upper 70s but again for all of us it's a very sticky day if you will here's super doppler and now we're seeing the leading edge of moisture it's tracking across the southern tier these are very slow moving rain showers nothing severe but the locally heavy rain could lead to potentially localized flooding as well we have some lightning across our northern pennsylvania viewing area but these showers could make a beeline for the metro area in the next several hours toward the mid late afternoon, we could see some rain here in the city of Buffalo. And it's all because of this very, very slow moving cold front. We have areas of low pressure, pieces of energy riding up along the front and it's slowing it down. So we're gonna keep it in place for the next several days. If you're headed out to food truck Thursday today, a mainly cloudy, there is a chance of showers, especially as we move toward the end of the afternoon, temperatures will be very very steamy in the low 80s and that muggy meter is running high right through the weekend. But notice the big drop coming our way. It's heading in here by Tuesday. In fact, the long range outlook does suggest that temperatures will be running below average once we get into the middle of August. So relief is on the way, but not just yet. Here's the hour by hour forecast. The model is not always it's not always uh, picking up on the heavy showers coming in, but there is the potential for this afternoon and for this evening off. So throughout the day tomorrow before showers start to taper once we get into Friday for today. High humidity with spot showers and thunderstorms, locally heavy downpours, highs in the 80s. Tonight, heavy downpours continue localized. And for tomorrow, staying humid with showers exiting toward the end of the day. Our super seven day forecast is calling for cool relief to get here by next Wednesday and Thursday with highs back into the 70s. We'll be right back.